Pruning fruit trees is actually really important to ensure their future productivity and health. I'm here with Dr. Michael Polozola, our statewide fruit and nut specialist, to talk about this. So Michael, let's talk about the reasons why we actually do need to prune our fruit trees. So there's many reasons. One, you want to increase airflow and sunlight, okay. and that's going to help you if you do need to spray your fruit trees, they'll be easier to spray. Mm -hmm. But it also helps you need to spray them less because you rely on nature to help you reduce that disease pressure good by point. having good airflow and sunlight to prevent humid mm -hmm. pockets. But each fruit tree needs a little bit different training strategy. Okay. So let's start with this peach down here. Mm -hmm. For our climate, especially in South Louisiana, you're gonna to wanna to have it open center or vase form, okay. growing kind of with four quadrants out. Now this one is not gonna be well conducive for that. So you would need to buy this and then cut it off about two and a half, two feet, and then okay. train new branches for it to make that open form. So that's a lot a of people don't like to do that. You're right. gonna to have to do significant cut right off. So we would also do that for a fig tree, correct? You, a fig okay. tree could do that okay. as well. Works really well for South Louisiana for that. Mm -hmm. Now this apple tree, you're not gonna grow that way. You're okay. gonna grow this one a modified central leader technique All right. where you want it to still be not too terribly tall mm -hmm. because you want to be able to pick Harvest, your apples, yeah. but you're going to work on training out scaffold limbs, but limbs that come out at 90 degrees angles are stronger and easier for sunlight and airflow to get through. So we would, as limbs came out, train them. This is a bit narrower angle than we like, but we could work mm -hmm. on this, probably top it, plant it, and we could keep going. To force new limbs to, to new grow. Limbs to okay. Now, All pecans, right. yeah. completely different. These we're aiming to get really big. Right. So these, we are pruning lower limbs a little bit up every year to push the fork up until you have something like this mm -hmm. where it's too big for you to get. And that's going to be what you need for long term for training your fruit trees. Well, thank you so much for sharing the basics on tree pruning for different types of fruit trees. For Get It Growing, I'm Jason Stagg with Dr. Michael Polozola for the LSU Ag Center.